Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, my name is Denise and if you can tell I have got the worst cold, <laughs> well not the worst cold ever, uh, but I am really really bunged up and my throat is absolutely killing me. Um, so yeah, thanks Ian, because <laughs> that's where I got it from. He's had a sore throat for about five days now. I thought I got away with it, but obviously not. Um, I did have a really scratchy throat last night um, and I thought, oh no, I'm going to wake up with it really, really bad. Um, and this morning, yes, it's really bad. Um, I have been... Um, out and got some um, lozenges and things. Um, I had to go out this morning to see if I could get some more yarn for the pink cardigan but it's absolutely pouring with rain here in London so he weren't there but I did also need to go and get another ball I've just dropped my, my hook on the floor of this from Panland um, to finish off Mikey's cardigan um, so I'm just literally piecing all the bits together now. Um, I just need to put the sleeve on and the hood and then I can sew, sorry about that, that was the hook. <laughs> then I just need to sew the sleeves and the seams and then go round the whole thing in the white um, and do a crab stitch. I know a lot of people don't really like crab stitch it doesn't really bother me to be honest I think that I've sort of got the knack for it and yeah I can just do it without any problems um, I also need to go around the edges of or the ends of the sleeving crab stitch too uh, I have finished the back of uh, the yellow jumper I have now put it in this bag as it wasn't actually in a bag it was just on my table um, so I've pulled out this bag from the wardrobe where my bags are stored. Um, they're in like a drawer set. Um, so <clears throat> this is how much of the third ball that I've got. I have put it on yarn. Like waist yarn, whatever you want to call it. So this is the back. What is that there? I just think it's where it's all, because it, it's just literally on this bit of yarn here. So this is the back so far. And I've had to cast off here um, for, I think it's the underarm. So this jumper is going to be really long. This is 64 centimetres. Um, <clears throat> and I've measured it up against... Um, a grey top that I normally wear that I have measured a few other of my jumpers against because I love the length of that, it's perfect for jeans, it's perfect for leggings and things um, and this is coming up literally the same size um, so it's really long uh, and I'm really looking forward to getting that done sorry my phone is um, going a bit mad <laughs> uh, but that's that um, today, like I said, I did go to the market and get um, some more of that yarn. I also picked up some more yarn in Panland. It's three for two, so I picked up some more of what Casey bought me at, uh, for my birthday. Just so I've got another two balls of that. Um, I'm thinking of making, maybe making some mittens or like some gloves and that um, with that yarn. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, but other than that I haven't really done anything else I haven't worked on the socks at all um, I have taken all my stitch markers out of that now sorry uh, you, you're on the table when I keep wobbling you um, and I know the back is 114 rows long the front is 116 rows long because each row is actually written out because there's cables and things that need to be done um so i've got my cable needle out i've got i think about eight of these that i've um accumulated over the years uh so yeah i've got my cable needle ready because once this is done i'm going back to the yellow jumper casting on for that and i think my mind will be a lot 
clearer just because I'm getting a bit overwhelmed with all the stuff that I had on the go. Uh, obviously I've got the pink jumper that I can't actually do at the moment because I haven't got the yarn. Um, this I didn't have the yarn but I have now so I want to get it done. This yellow jumper, I really think the front is going to work up a lot quicker because every row is written out and plus it's cable so there's an actual pattern to it, it's just not stocking stitch. So I'm thinking it might uh, work up a lot quicker. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's all really that I've been doing. The other thing that I picked up from Poundland today is um, a pack of these. I've got one open already, but a pack of these, and eight in all. So they're just little booklets and I thought that they would be really good for, and I know I'm, I'm trying to say that I don't want too many projects on the go, um, but I think they'll be really good to have in each project bag. Um, <clears throat> maybe if I get the yarn out and have it in a bag ready to start or whatever, and I can put, it's just lined paper basically. Um, I don't know how many sheets are in there, but... As you can see, it is quite thin, but it's quite a handy size just to put in a, a project bag. Um, so, yeah, I'm working on <laughs> with, with one of these already. So you get pink, green, orange and yellow fronts, but they're just like little plastic front um, things. So I picked up those. Um, did I pick up anything else that was very interesting today? no not really <laughs> um, so I'm going to just carry on with this and see um, I do really want to get this done I just need to join this sleeve that's um, joined by one stitch and a, a stitch marker <laughs> so I will get that done now and then um, put the hood on and then go around it and I'm really I, I, it's, it's half past three um, Ian should be home anytime soon um, that's if he's not going to the garage I don't actually know um, he said he's going to let me know um, but yeah so I'm going to do this now and hopefully have a finished Mikey cardigan by the end of the day <laughs> um, <clears throat> so I'm not planning on doing anything this evening he, Ian, oh I've just, I've just took that stitch out <laughs> Ian did say um, did I want to meet him at the garage and it's absolutely pouring with rain and I was just like no I don't feel well as it is so I'm just going to stay in <laughs> um, but yeah so I'm going to work on this um, I might come back a little bit later show you it finished fingers crossed and uh, any other progress that I get done on anything hopefully this won't take me that long and I can block it tomorrow because um, blocking don't take that long I'm going to steam block it so that won't take that long uh, <clears throat> yeah, I'm going to go stop talking, rest my voice, and I shall speak to you a bit later.